Today we are taking a look at the best three formations in FC24. D5212, D4321 and my personal favourite, the 352. But before we get to that, a quick word from our sponsor. Today's video is sponsored by World of Warships. World of Warships is a free to play game available for your mobile, PC and console. I'm new to World of Warships so I've been enjoying using the in-game starter pack that's worth 25 euro. You can also get access to this pack for free by using the link in the description. There are more than 650 historical ships available to play which spread around 13 different nations. Ships are divided into 5 different classes, the destroyers, the cruisers, the battleships, the air carriers and also submarines. And all of these ships are based on real historical documents and actual blueprints from the first half of the 20th century. When I seen these stunning graphics, the wide variety of maps and how dramatically the weather conditions impact the gameplay, I was shocked that this game is free to play. So please help support my channel by downloading World of Warships today for free using the link in the description. And did I mention by using that link you get a free starter pack that's worth 25 euro? Thank you to World of Warships for sponsoring this video. Starting off with the 5212, now let's not get confused, the 5 at the back does not automatically mean it is a defensive formation, it's actually a very attacking formation. So starting off with the in-game tactics, we're going to have defensive style on balance, that's the same across the board, it is the best defensive style in the game, we're going to have the wit on 40 and the depth on 65. Some people do still like to use 71, 72 depth, for me, it's not quite meta anymore. 65, you kind of get best of both worlds. You have your players pressing, but you're not doing the offside trap. 65 is, for me, perfect. Build a play, we have this on long ball. Now, this doesn't mean what you think in the traditional sense of football. In FC24, long ball just encourages your players to make them runs in behind. And then chance creation, direct pass. Once again, this is the same across the board. It is the best chance creation in the game. Direct pass, you need to be running this. Which we're going to leave that on default on 50. Players in the box bring this up slightly to about 7. Corners and free kicks, this is all personal preference. Personally, I like corners on 3 and free kicks on 2 because you're probably going to shoot from your free kicks anyway. So 2 is just fine. So into the player instructions, you want both strikers to stay central and stay forward. Your camp to just stay forward. Your both of your centre mids to stay back while attacking and cover centre and your left wing back and your right wing back to join attack and overlap. So that's all for the 5 2 one, 2 let's move on to the 4 3 2 one So the 4 3 2 one has dominated FC24 for quite a while now and it is still right there on top. Starting off with the tactics once again, defensive style on balance across the board, we have that the whole way through, which we're going to bring that slightly down to 45 and depth, like I said, somewhere around 60, 65 is about good. Build a play, we're going to have this on balance this time, that works best with this formation. Chance creation on direct pass. Like I said, it is the best chance creation in the game. You have to run this pretty much on every formation in this game. With bring that down slightly to 45. I like to keep things quite narrow in this formation. Players in the box bring this up slightly to 7. And once again, corners and free kick all down to personal preference. I like to have mine on 3 and 2. Now moving on to the player instructions. These ones are a little bit more advanced than the fire 2 one two, So I'll take my time a bit more <laughs> with this one. Striker, you want them on stay central, get in behind and stay forward. Your left forward on stay central and get in behind and your camp to stay central, get in behind and come back on the fence. Now your left center mid, have him on, get into the box or crosses, leave everything else on default. Your central center mid to stay back while attacking, stay on the edge of the box or crosses and cover center. And your right center mid to stay back while attacking, get into the box for crosses and cover center. Your left back to stay back while attacking and overlap. And your right back to join attack and overlap. Like I said, this formation has been at the top of SC24 now for quite a while and for good reason. This formation dominates the game. But I think I've found one that is just slightly better since the new update, the 352. But first, let me show you how good it really is. A bit of luck there with the bad clearance at Ribery with the finesse 1-0. What do we have here? Zidane to Ribery finesse. What a goal. What a pass. Oh, we got so lucky there. Okay, to be fair, not the best goal. Oh, rage quit. 
Saka. Good overlap. Pele. Great goal. Great goal. I love that overlap from Zidane. Oh, Ribery. He doesn't miss these finesse. He never, ever misses them. But a right quick. What do we have here? Saka. Work it. I actually didn't mean to pass that to Zidane, but, but we'll take it. Who's there? Ribery. Oh, what a finish. With his weak foot as well. What a pass. Zidane. Sack it. Take the shot. That was a great finish there. Another rage quit. That's three in a row. Oh, great finish, Ribery. Of course, like I said, the finesse shot, he never, ever misses them. Great pass to Pele. Just unmarked. He's not going to miss from there. Oh, Zidane. What a run from the midfield. I swear he never scores this much. Oh, the space for Frimpong, 99 pace. What do we have in the box here? Okay, sweaty goals. Zidane. He never scores this much. Oh, Zidane again from the midfield. He's just unmarked. It's so easy. Another rage quit. Okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. So starting off with the tactics for the 352 defensive style on balance with on 40 depth on 60 build a play on balanced chance creation once again on direct past with up that 260 players in the box leave that on default corners as i said personal preference three and two works best for me moving over to the player instructions both strikers to stay forward your camp completely on default do not touch him both your left and right mid on comeback on the fence, get in behind and get into the box for crosses. Think of both of them as kind of defenders. You want them to be good attackingly, but also good defensively. And have both CDMs on stay back while attacking and cover center. So yeah, there's the three best formations in FC24 right now. Like I said, the 352 for me is my personal favorite. It's the one I recommend you guys to try, but the 4231 and the 5212 are both still very good formations in this game. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you do want to see more. I would really appreciate it. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.